feel like I'm at the end of the world. This is cool. Had some funky precipitation up here. Yeah, we got black tusk. Got the which valley's down there? The Chequemus Valley. Chequemus Lake, just over there. And uh, yeah. Beauty. Okay, so it's a beautiful Saturday and we came up early out into, I guess what you would consider slack country in Whistler. Symphony Chair is just over here. It's not actually running yet. And Flute Mountain, Flute Peak? Flute Mountain? Flute Peak? I don't know. <laughs> Flute is up above us. So we are headed, following the tracks up to the top. We're about a quarter of the way up at the moment. And yeah, this is just a great thing to do early in the season, trying to build up our, our lungs. So it's a great early season coming out here, just trying to build up the fitness and get used to doing these hikes and just understanding the body. Plus like, it's a great little spot just to get away from on the crowds. You come out here. It's like paradise. All right, so a good tip when you guys are hiking up where there's skin tracks, you don't want to hike on the skin tracks because it kind of ruins it for all the people using it afterwards. So especially here, walking track on the side, use that and keep the skin track for the skinners. Oh. Gotta be careful here. see we're actually just about the top of where we want to go the top of flute and what a view this thing is just unreal so we got symphonies the first one there visible and then harmony harmony ridge coming all down through there and all of this is just glorious this is uh this is xanadu right here and yeah the hike up has been pretty good pretty mellow we've just been taking our time enjoying it day. Just the top of the world here. Oh, it's people coming back, eh? So uh, we're just at the end where there's a couple cornices and not very big ones, but uh, this is the steepest, most technical part of flute and nice, more mellow way over the backside of there. So we're just gonna cruise on down there, grab some lunch. Yes, yeah, so we're hoping to follow the sunshine down over here, over the back of this second knoll. It's kind of the second peak and yeah, some nice cruisy lines down the back, some more sunshine and down in the symphony and then hiking out. Thank you.
Sorry, I don't have any food. He's so disappointed. Mm. You want to come in too? We're just hanging. Do you want to just come hang out for a sec? No. Oh. Um. Speechless. That was great. <laughs> Cause we're uh, you can see you can, as long as you don't want to just you don't want to fall over to the right. No, no. I can still get around the corner. Here. Oh, you're sweet over there. Yeah, a lot of avi. I mean, it looks fine, but there's a lot of avi debris. Straight to the left, there's this grouping of like four or five tracks. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So do we want to go on the far side of those tracks or the near side of those tracks? Cool. Yeah. Yes, sir. On the far, far side. Yeah. Let's go do that. Should we just keep following the traverse? Or do you want to cut down and go diagonal? I think I'm just following you at this point, so. I think if we want to go far, which I'm fine with, we follow this traverse for a bit longer and okay. then we just dip. Sounds good to me, yeah. Okay. But actually, well, we don't need to fall, because we could go a little bit lower to hit the powder, yeah, but yeah. to keep cutting across. Let's keep going, yep, yep. You almost want to go like a bit slower and you just follow the terrain.
<laughs> that was great. Very interesting snow down here, but it's still super fun. Yeah, you guys kind of hear it now because I'm total flat base, but there's huge crust under here. Oh, oh my god! There it is! <laughs> that crust is something. Camera guy's here. Oh yeah. Work the terrain, keep your face flat. Woohoo! We did it! We're geniuses. Yeah, thanks for having me out, dude. Great hike. Yeah. Great rip. It's amazing how the snow changes so much Absolutely. just in that one run. But even here where it's like a lot of powder, ultimate crust. Yeah. You almost just, I was finding best for me, just letting the train push me where it wants yep. to go. Yep. Keep that base flat. And just ride it. There were so many kickers that I wanted to hit, but I know what's underneath. So yeah, scary. this has been great though. The sun's oh. coming through here right now. Oh, look at that. Yeah, eh? I found a piece of ice for you. Oh, thank you. I'll take that home. That's uh, now that's just, someone's going to hit that and eat it. I split Five it. Points. Split it. Wow. There you go. Look, it's funny too because like it's just one hand. It's that's a big. Oh. Oh, that's a big one. Oh, it wants to come off bigger. All right, Chris. Hike out time. Well. Wait, well, a little ski right ski down a bit more. Do we want to? No. No, we're good here. No, we're good here. Oh, wait a minute, we're on the. We're on the blue. This is the cat. Like okay. normally that you'd ride out, right? Shh. To the chair. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this is it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I had a feeling in here. Yeah. I thought I knew this. Uh, this is actually one of the areas I know least well. But... Oh, I've been discovering this, so I actually can say that on the other side of this, I know very well now. Nice. Oh, my tiny whistle, guys. <laughs> oh, that and I know where all the good treat shops are. It's a nice cruise down. Follow you. Aha. Ah, almost. Almost had that. Oh. <laughs> you did. <laughs> This is the lift anyway, so we're here. We made it. Now we just need to get Symphony to start going. All right, we made it. All right, so as you guys can see, bottom of a Symphony chair. It's obviously not open at the moment, but I'm sure they'll be opening up soon. Um, and yeah, we just have to do a little bit of a hike out of here. It's been such an awesome cruise down. This is definitely my type of snowboarding adventure. Just mellow, calm, cruisy day in the sunshine. Again, away from the crowds on a Saturday. And uh, just 
having some good time. Me and Mr. Cameraman over there is, I know to you guys he looks like a, an ethereal kind of being, but he's been a, a sweet little buddy to come out. So thanks, Adam. And thanks everybody else for watching and thanks for coming out and enjoying this. Uh, yeah, hopefully you guys are able to ride soon. I know I say it every week, but I do feel for all you guys that can't ride. Yeah, hopefully, fingers crossed, get some snow, grab some boards, do some hikes. And um, yeah, just get out there because it's glorious. I feel like the king of the world. All right, guys. Well, thanks for coming down. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. But also, do not load. See you in the next video. Ta-ra!